But, yeah, I mean, I remember Vice City. Were you, are you a fan of the Grand Theft Auto series at all? Oh, definitely. Yeah, oh, I yeah. The hell out of that. I mean, Breaking Bad basically is Grand Theft Auto, the miniseries. I don't know. I wouldn't say that. I mean, come on. It's just less emphasis on cars. That's about it. It's building your little criminal empire. I mean, I remember Vice City. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's pretty simplified. But, yeah, I mean, Breaking Bad's a hell of a lot better than Grand Theft Auto was crap. What? It was, it, Grand Theft Auto was a lot of fun, but let's be honest, it was crap. It was easy. I mean, it was pretty shitty. Jesus, dude. Well, anyway. <laughs> I mean, I really, I mean, you know, it was fun. Well, like I just... Grand Theft Auto 4. Like, was there anything in Grand Theft Auto 4 for PS3, Xbox, 360, whatever you played it on, that wasn't in Grand Theft Auto Vice City? Uh, not, I mean, it, okay, fine. I'm not going to get an argument about more. I mean, I really enjoyed the series. If they're not your cup of tea, I don't even care. Uh, but I'm saying is, like, you, you played Vice City, right? You played Vice uh, City. Yeah. And I remember I was, it was awesome. I mean, you know, you just get in your car. You drive around to all the businesses you own. You pick oh, up the... by the way, no, no, it was my cup of tea. I loved the games. I was just saying that Breaking Bad was a lot better than that. Well, but, I mean, look at, like, the train heist and things like that. That's such a Grand Theft Auto mission. Yeah, it is. Yeah, and the whole, just yeah, yeah, yeah. And a guy who starts off as an amateur building his own criminal empire. Mm -hmm. and, and, and the neurotic characters, that's the other Grand Theft Auto thing. It's like you never just meet some regular, I mean, you, yeah, you, yeah, you yeah. never. The guy you, that, uh, what really fucked me up was the guy that helped him rob the train was the Friday Night Lights. That fucked me up a little bit. Oh, yeah? I never watched Friday Night Lights. But I, I, I started wa that's the that's the bummer about Netflix, is you can watch some show you would have never watched. Like, if you were just channel surfing, you would have never watched Friday Night Lights, right? But it's on Netflix, so you watch the first, like, you, you can watch as many episodes as you want, so you just start watching one episode. Is that the one about the kids and the football? It's, it's about football, of all shit that I... Oh, seen. Jesus Christ, yeah, I know I that movie. That fucking show. And it's basically like these fundamentalist, basic Texas Christian family football. The whole worst shit. Everything that I hate. And I watched the entire goddamn thing. I saw that movie so many times because there was this person. Who movie? Really... No, this is a series. Oh. Isn't there a movie? I know what you're saying. You're saying Varsity Blues. Which is basically Friday Night Lights, the movie. <laughs> But no, it was a completely different thing. Friday Night Lights was a series. And I have no idea what channel it came on because I watched most of it on Netflix. Anyway, I put in a mod rec. Someone should be along to uh, give you building permissions here. Okay. You don't have permission for this area. Yeah, you're not you're not with the you're not with the potato pickers union yet. <laughs> yeah, but I remember uh, Vice City was the first to introduce that element. Instead of just doing missions and being a a lackey or a hitman, you you made your money just by getting in your Ferrari or whatever they called it. I think they called it like an Inferno, and you just dr cruise around town and pick up the money that's been accumulated at your various laundering businesses. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But Skylar doesn't understand this concept because she's <laughs> fucking retarded. She doesn't under. I mean, she. It's like, hey, you remember Gus? Well, yeah, Walter probably should have just kept lying to her. I mean, yeah. I, I mean, here's. Well, he's so fucking stupid. I mean, he's stupid for trusting. He's like, just give he was a crime. Reckless. He was pretty reckless. Well, I mean, it's it's like, okay, fine. You want to shut her up, make her feel important, fine. Give her like one. 1% of your earnings for her to launder so she feels like she's doing something important, right? Just keep a retard busy. You know what I mean? Just <laughs> get... I would have just probably killed her. Yeah, I would have as well. But I mean, I then... Mean, I, mean, for, I mean, you think about all the trouble she caused him. Yes. Right? You know, I probably just would have buried her, drowned her in the pool, which was always my fantasy for Breaking Bad. I was like, any minute now, Walter's going to take her out back give her a slow dance, and then drown her in the pool, yeah. bury her in the yard, Walter <laughs> Jr. is going to poke at the hole with his crutches, 
and be really suspicious for like three seasons. <laughs> Nobody's ever going to find the fucking body. And she's just going to rot back there. And her sister's going to throw a big manic depressive fit. And Hank's going to be like, oh, you're being silly. And then slap her around a little bit. <laughs> might be the end of the series. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I. Those were my wishes for Skylar, especially after the uh, whole bailout incident with the idiot that she was having the affair with. Yeah, that guy was just a huge chump. <laughs> he was the worst kind of fucking chump. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, yeah. He's like, okay, she's outraged at Walter's illegal activities. Finds out that the guy she's fucking is doing something is into something similar. Doesn't give a shit. Doesn't bat a fucking eye. Barely. I mean, it's just ridiculous. Uh, someone said that they're handling their quest, but I didn't see them teleport over here. Did you see someone teleport in here? Oh, there's there's Drasana. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty ridiculous. But, I mean, did she not take notice of the fact that Gus, for example, after she found out about Gus, uh, he had a whole chain of restaurants, not just one Gus's chicken shack. Right. You know, I mean, what do you not understand? I mean, it doesn't matter if the businesses are crap. Yeah. Okay, there. Now you should be able to do stuff. But it's already all dug up. Right? Yeah, it is. Okay, so let's uh, <laughs> let's go to another location. Wait, here's a couple. There's a, there's a couple plants. Oh, those uh, those aren't ripe. Oh no, they're not. Damn, they from afar they look such. Okay. Get but I mean, what what did she not understand? Just keep buying locations, keep buying car washes or whatever. You know, buy your supplier for this kind of. You know, do whatever. But it, it, that it, that was Walter's fault. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. He's, he should have just given her. Like some very small sum, just to keep her feeling. Yeah, just you know, occupy the moron. Yeah, right? exactly. Give her a card, and on both sides it says, "How do you keep a stupid cunt, you know, occupied?" <laughs> Flip the yeah, card, card over, over to find out. I used to have that keychain. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see here. All hey, right. Hey. Oh, you know what else? I did. I finally saw uh, Lincoln. Oh, I haven't seen that yet. Uh, I have to side with the people that you've been talking to. I was really not impressed with it at all. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah. That, uh, Tommy Lee Jones was in there, right? Yeah, and he did, he did a good job. There, there were there were good performances. Yeah. But of course, I mean, people. A lot of uh, critics were kissing. Uh, I mean, and the thing is, normally I like. Uh, Normally I like, what's his name, uh, Daniel Day-Lewis. I think he's great, but it just was a forgettable movie, you know? Yeah. Oh, shit, we got to replant. Uh, to replant, have a stack of potatoes in your hand. Yeah, I've got 35, but hold on one second. Yeah, I mean, uh, eventually uh, I'm going to get us our own server. But right now it j I just thought this would be easier to just jump right in and start building on another server. Also, this server has some cool stuff on it. One one of these days that we're gonna we need to take a tour and uh, show off what other people have built. Like even from up here, you can see the Adventurers Guild down there, which is a really nice building. All right, I got that site saved. Okay, cool. All right. Now uh, I already took care of the potatoes, so just hop down here. We have almost every crop. I think that uh, we have everything but cactus and uh, nether netherwort. Yeah, we have everything but that. Here's uh, pumpkins. So we have potatoes, carrots, wheat, lots of cocoa.
How do you replant again? Uh, and well, that's that's a great thing about that's a great thing about uh, pumpkins and uh, oh, you no, oh, you just okay. That's that's fine. Uh, you were not actually supposed to destroy the stems. Yeah, the thing about um, the thing about pumpkins and melons is you see these stems when they're fully grown, they'll just keep sprouting more and more, so you don't have to replant, which makes them awesome. Okay. But you don't want to you don't want to dig up those stems. It's not a big deal. We don't need massive pumpkins. Although the pumpkins are worth a fair amount of cash, uh, all the crops really are. Cocoa is probably the most lucrative. Cocoa's our massive, massive cash crop. You see these uh, leaves? We're eventually going to just make it a giant canopy of leaves, and, and then we're going to have to get branches out. Also, as, as you're going around this place, once you get better at building, and by better I mean you're capable of doing... No, I, I, won't, even, I won't even go there. <laughs> I won't even go there. I've given you enough grief about it. But uh, once you get better at building, you, can, you have a free hand to build stairs, roads... Uh, put up fence posts as guardrails and so forth, uh, because that's all I did. I would just be standing on one platform, and I'd look at a platform that was nearby, and I'd be like, I really want to get over there, so I'd just bridge out to it, right? And then eventually I'd just put up this massive canopy of leaves, so now you can walk. This place used to be so nightmarishly dangerous. I mean, holy shit, how long did you guys spend on this? Uh, I don't know, a couple minutes every day. Well, actually, I've, I've been on this. Oh, yes. What's it? Huh? Oh, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Here's some carrots. I need to expand this carrot farm. I just had a bare minimum of carrots to feed the pigs. So yeah, it's uh, a giant farming commune in the sky. We uh, we pick the crops, we feed the animals, we rear and raise the animals. Uh, do you want to? Uh, your your kick. Look, if you if you can't see the carrot or potato itself, it means it's not ripe, and you're just destroying shit. Um, Here, you need to replant these carrots. Uh, which is the how? Take a carrot and right click on the tilled soil. Just cl yeah, there you go. All right, there. There we go. So yeah, you just make exponentially more carrots, and then the carrots can feed pigs, or you can use them for other things. Killer. Uh, here's where I planted some grass up in the sky. You can uh, buy grass at the. Uh, I'm, I'm going to eventually turn this area into like a park, right? Uh, you can buy grass at the in-game store on the server. <clears throat> Normally what you'd have to do is use pistons or or bridge up with dirt and push with pistons all the way up into the sky, but luckily I didn't have to do that. <clears throat> okay, so that's this top tier. Down here we have cows. Lots of them. Oh, wow. <laughs> now what we're going to do is we're just going to keep... Uh, what you, cows eat wheat. Now uh, how the hell did you create the cows? Oh, we didn't... I didn't create them. I, uh... Here... <laughs> Um, I'm stuck with the cows. There's there's a ladder on the side. I'll, I'll stand oh, where it is. Cool. Oh, I see it. Right. Yeah, you can jump on it, climb up. Cool. Okay, cool. Uh, let me show you. <laughs> uh, he got eaten by a mob of hungry cows. Mm. It, that would be like, uh, what was that movie, Hannibal? Oh, I know. I was, that's what I was thinking about. The training of the pigs? Yeah. Okay, do, do you... <laughs> Can you see a, a long line going down to the surface of the planet? Uh, yes. That was a rail. And what I did is I corralled some uh, different kinds of animals at the uh, the bottom, and then I used uh, ra powered carts to drive them all the way up into the sky, and then I separated them out. Yeah, this game has a lot of stuff that you haven't seen yet. It's uh, yeah. That's also how I got... Oh, wait, no, I used the prisoner for a... Uh, 
Uh, I'm, I'm going to have to take some time out at some point. And just, uh, I, I know I've already said this, but when I actually have some free time that I can spend on this game. Well, you can also go into your single-player world and just derp around from scratch. Right. That's kind of what I want to do is kind of develop my own structure. And you should record that. Do you have any recording? Uh, no, I haven't uh, bothered with that yet. Oh, okay. Well, never mind then. We can do screen cap on Skype, and I could record. But I mean, that, that's, but there's, I mean, the whole point is that you can do it on your own time. So yeah, there's cows. There's uh, some watermelons over there. If you climb down here, did you see where I went? Yeah. There's uh, oop, uh, it took a little damage. Here's the wheat farm. Now here's the important thing about wheat. See the color? How some of them yeah. are a bit different. When they have these brown things at the top, and they're they're not yeah. all green. That's when that's when the wheat is ready to be harvested, and you just again you hold down. I'm going to pick some unripe wheat by mistake, I'm sure, but uh, it gives you seeds and it gives you wheat. Wheat makes bread, but it also is used to feed cows. Um, cows eat wheat, pigs eat carrots, chickens eat seeds. So when you pick uh, when you harvest wheat, uh, you use the seeds to replant, but you'll usually have some left over. So then you have food for both. So this uh, green shit right here, it's yeah, not mess with it. Not right? ripe enough, yeah. Okay. So you have seeds to feed chickens and wheat to feed cows. Oh, and you can also milk cows. Nice. So, yep, yeah, it's a farming oh. simulator. But I mean, oh, at the end of the day. Seeds, wheat, What's that? No, I was just going through my inventory. Do you have any carrots left over? Um, yeah, I got 11. Okay, yeah, you can come over here and feed the pigs. Just throw carrots? No, don't throw them. Uh, put a carrot in your hand. Now see how they all look at you? <laughs> right, yeah. yeah. <laughs> right click on them. Ah. I see a bunch of hearts. Yeah, good. Just click on They're them. Eating. Just keep clicking on them. Feed them all carrots. Oh, now see, look. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. Ah, more pigs. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> nice. So it's like we're running up. I didn't up. realize carrots were an aphrodisiac. They are. Every food is an aphrodisiac in this game. <laughs> you can put your spare carrots in this chest. To your. Oh wait, no, you can't because you don't have. I'll 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 go around opening all these chests, like I said. But right now, just hold on to the spare carrots. Uh, okay. over here we have, uh, pools. I'm going to put some fishing rods over here, and you're going to be able to fish in these ponds. Killer. Which I know doesn't make a lot... Oh, don't drown, please. No, that's good. That's dangerous. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't worry. I noticed the danger immediately. Uh, drowning and standing on a cliff. Yeah, all very dangerous. All right, now head over here. Yeah, oh man, like I said, Jeg and I both died many, many times before I put the leaves in. I mean, imagine, okay, I, I, it's too bad you didn't get here sooner because this place, the the, uh, the thumbnail I'm uploading for the series is before I started adding the leaves and it looks like such a bizarre structure. Yeah, I saw that. You had the same thumbnail in every video. Yeah. So we actually have tree farms in a tree. Down here we have some sugar cane. This place can be tough to find. Shit, dude, I feel like like you guys have done so much goddamn work on this. Uh, we have, we have. This is a two. This is actually a two-story sugarcane farm. Sugar is easy, really easy to grow once you find your first batch of it. You, what you, uh, it's like melons. You don't, uh, you don't pick it all. You just pick the top two stems. I mean, the top two blocks of it, and you leave the bottom, and then it sort of regenerates. So Although it's right now it's lagging, so it's not dropping, which is hilarious. Mm. Yeah, you just hit the middle stock, and what happens is, uh, well, the the top one is supposed to fall okay. down. Okay. Wow, what the hell was that? What? Connection lost. Oh yeah, that's probably it's yeah. <laughs> I was wondering, uh, 